Um, this is a very important and I think very timely initiative. And I say this as somebody who is in the Ministry of Tourism, yes, but whose professional life and experience is primarily in community, dealing with communities. And I've said it, I said it from day one coming into tourism, if tourism is going to be sustainable, it has to be driven by communities, by people. This is not going to be a destination that will survive on just the big hotels and the sea and the sand. We have to be able to show that we are unique. We have to be able to show that we are competitive, we are authentic. And the only way we do that is by showing who we are as a people, our history, our culture, our heritage, all of that. That's what you have. That's what you have. And that's what you have to display. That's what you have to show the whole world. And trust me, if you show the whole world that, you will get the biggest slice of the pie. Forget about what the hotels do. That is what the visitor is coming for. And if you can package that, package that well, you will, you will get the slice of the pie. There's no question in my mind about it. What is important is for you to organize yourself. And I think this forum, and I wasn't part of it, but just listening to what you were saying, listening to the little bit at the end, it's clear to me that you now have a confidence that this can happen. Having the confidence is good. Making it happen is the is the is the key thing now. Is the key thing now. And I, I did I did hear Mr. Crockett say something to that effect anyway. Let's not focus on trying to put this perfect thing together. That may take that may take a while. But there are things we can do now that can propel us forward. Let's Let's focus on that. And from the ministry standpoint, we are very much committed to working to develop community tourism, heritage tourism, call it all what you want, but any product that is going to be formed, visioned, implemented, monitored at the community level, we want to be part of it. And so wherever and however we can support, we will want to do so. Very happy that the Ufort Tourism Group is is here. I think that is a very good start in terms of having a group of committed individuals who can drive this forward. But every one of you in your individual capacities must drive it. Okay, so I want to encourage you to do that. Keep the enthusiasm, keep the momentum going, and I will assure you that the ministry will try to support you in whatever way we can. But it is clear in my mind, and certainly from the ministry standpoint, that this is where we have to be. So, congratulations, good luck, all the best. But I'm sure in years to come, we will look upon this particular occasion as the occasion where the pie started to come down south. <laughs>